Good day, my, my name is Shaul and I uh, work for company Micrographics and we can be found on the web at www.mgfx.co.za Alright, so as you know Lumen 11 has been uh, released and one of the features that I will be looking at in this video is the volumetric fire. Now, and uh, what it allows us to do is to create more realistic uh, a fire with different shapes and lots of settings. Right, so let's get into it. I'm just going to open up a plane uh, uh, model and um, <coughs> here I'm now going to just look at placing an existing uh, piece of uh, fire. So I'm just going to go to the effects and I'm going to go to place. Uh, once I go to place uh, it pops up the, the menus. Obviously at the top uh, you'll see the different uh, 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 categories in this case of a uh, selected fire there's only one page right so I'm just going to place uh, one of the existing fires that has been um, uh, you know in the in the, the software right and then I'll also place uh, uh, one of the new f uh, volumetric fi uh, fires you'll see these different shapes that you can uh, 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 add right so I'm just going to uh, uh, create a normal uh, you know option right um, Okay, so if I go to the select uh, option, uh, looking at the existing one, you'll see you've got um, the, the the area size, uh, partic uh, particle count, so you can have it uh, not as uh, kind of dense. Um, right, the spread you can also increase the size of the fire, so it's the height, um, the color of the fire, and the brightness. Right, so you've got a couple of settings on the um, uh, normal. Uh, existing one. The new one here has, um, if you uh, select that, has got different uh, options. Uh, you can change the width, uh, the length, as well as uh, you know the height. Um, you've also got uh, turbulence as well as uh, the intensity. The intensity increases the the uh, uh, the amount of information, and um, this allows you to uh, uh, create a more realistic uh, a fire uh, and also as I mentioned there is more shapes that can be added uh, if I just pick up uh, you know uh, one of these uh, shapes um, and I'll go and change the settings you'll notice that uh, first I'm just going to uh, increase uh, the intensity you know there's the height um, and uh, you know there's the width I was going to reduce that a little bit Alright, so basically uh, it allows us to, you know, have different shapes, more uh, more real realism has been included, and uh, uh, um, that allows us to uh, create a better looking uh, um, model and information. Right, so thank you for watching. I hope you learned something uh, uh, creating uh, your new fires and. Um, uh, you can use it in your models. Thank you. See you in the next one.